Hey guys, it's Shut Up and Game Gaiden, and I'm here to do another part of the Assassin's Creed, but, uh, Assassin's Creed 3 Let's Play. By any chance, John and Isabella's son. And here we are in Boston. Your commission is with Edward Braddock, is it not? Aye. But he's yet to reach America, and I figured I might. Well, at least until he arrives, I thought. Yes? Out with it? Forgive me, sir. I had. I had hoped that I might study Hello, under you. Sir. If I am to serve the order, I can imagine no better mentor than yourself. Kind of you to say, but I think you overestimate me. Impossible, sir. This way. Boston's quite a lively city. There's all manner of things to see and do. Once you've settled in, I suggest you take some time to walk this way. Who knows what opportunities you tell this isn't present-day Boston because nobody thinks we'll get to work. Us. I'll arrange for horses while you do that. Dead motherfucking Franklin. The city will be the death of me. You seem troubled, friend. That's because I am. Greatly so, in fact. What's happened? I was robbed. The old Balkan file. How <laughs> I've managed to restore what's mine, I fear it's ruined. You mean the book? This is no ordinary book. It's an almanac. The first I ever wrote. <clears throat> Benjamin Franklin. Pleased to meet you. Haytham Kenway. You must be new to Boston. Why do you say that? You're still possessed of virtue. <laughs> to stop and help an old lout like myself. I... I don't mean to impose, but... You seem a spry fellow. Should you happen to find my missing pages, I'll reward you. Look, I'm not sure if I... It's all right, all right. If you have the time, hurrah! If not, no harm done. The thing is useless in its current state anyway. But should you somehow manage to restore it, you'll find me inside that general store over there. Yeah, that's right. If you want, you can help Ben motherfucking Franklin. That was interesting. But you don't have to, so you're probably not living with it. What do you need, my friend? Normal sword. Not a special sword. Alright, got everything I need. Put your paper bro on the shoe. Need your package up. Collins Barriers of Needle Street. Place to go. We ride for the Green Dragon Tavern. The proprietors are eccentric, but the rooms are spacious. God damn it, horse. Have you been told why it is I've come to Boston? No. Master Birch said I should know only as much as you saw fit to share. He sent me a list of names and bade me ensure you could find them. And have you had hey. any with that? Hi. William Johnson waits for us at the Green Dragon. Okay. Not well, but he saw the order's mark and did not hesitate to come. Prove yourself loyal to our cause, and you may yet know our plans as well. 
I should like nothing more, sir. A lion, cheating no good, son of a bitch. Perhaps we've come at a bad time. Oh, don't be foolish, dearies. Please, sit. Fancy something to eat? A drink, perhaps? Or is it a bed you require? We've already let rooms here. Oh, yes. <laughs> of course. Masters Lee and Kenway, uh, was it? Ah, uh, I'll have your bags brought up. Do you require anything further? <coughs> Only privacy. Where's Charles Lee? Not much goes on for quite a while. Get to doing something eventually. Sir, William Johnson. A pleasure. A good lad, if a bit earnest. I'm told you're putting together an... You believe there's a precursor site in the region. I require your knowledge of the land and its people to find it. Sadly, my research has been stolen. Without it, I'm of no use to you. Then we'll find it. Do you have any leads? My associate, Thomas Hickey, has been making the rounds. He's quite good at loosening talk. Well, tell me where I can find him. I'll see if I can't speed things up. We've heard rumors of bandits operating from a compound southwest of here. You'll likely... Charles? Sir. We'd best be off. Of course. Charles. Thomas Hickey? Who's asking? Haytham Kenway. Is that supposed to mean something? You show some respect, boy. Peace, Charles. William Johnson sent us in the hopes we might expedite your search. <laughs> Don't need none of your fancy London speak, neither. I found the men that done the theft. Then why are you just lazing around? Go kill him. Figuring out how to deal with those varlets. I have an idea. Well, let's hear it. I'll kill the lookout. Take up a position behind the guard. Uh, you two approach from the front. When I open fire on the group, you charge in. About the element of outside. Half or four before they've even realized what's happened. into position but wait for me to take nobody it. heard that nobody not a single person it was like oh
the second thing we're going to ask if this piece of shit does. Go on now, before you make us mad. Blam. counter in this game you automatically win. Like that. It's not incredibly hard. Fall back! Fall back! We'll be safe inside! Blow the door with those. Go on, shoot them. Lay down your weapons, and I'll consider letting you live. I make you the same. We've no quarrel. I only wish to return this chest to its rightful owner. Nothing rightful about the assassins unchained. I won't ask again. Agreed. Kind is no need for books and maps. Who put you up? Never seen a person. It's always been dead drops and letters. But they always pay, so we do the job. It's a mystery. Well, those days are done. Tell your masters I said as much. <laughs> Who should I say you are? You don't. They'll know. Atham, this one's got some shot on him. You might want to be grabbing it on account of your pistol. <laughs> A shame so many had to die. Aye. Terrible Loot. Tragedy, that. Loot. Back to the Green Dragon, then. Yeah, I need fun. a drink. Hey guys, come on. Show the chest, Charles. We'll take care of this rebel. Hey. Look at Wait, them bodies is sure to have loot on them. Would be a shame to let it. Oh, you guys are gonna get fucking killed while I'm looting. In case you've forgotten, we're in the midst of something. Aww. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys.
running circles around you. It's not the scoundrels I'm concerned with. Oh man, this is intense. Order to kill a cat. Ah, that's cool. Assassins can't even kill one douchebag with a gun. Two douchebags with a gun. Okay, my gun is not reloading. Reload. Alright. That seems to be the last of them. Okay, let's go. Oi! Mr. Johnson's gonna need to double my pay after all this uh, if he no, expects no. me to keep at his side. There you are. My thanks, Master Kinray. No. Tell me what it is you need. The images on this amulet, are they familiar? Perhaps one of the tribes has shown you something similar. It appears Kanyan Gahaga in origin. Can you trace it to a specific location? I need to know where it came from. With my research returned, perhaps. Let me see what I can do. Of course, the Indians are mystical, magical, Whoa. technology, alien descendant people. Because you can't have non racist Indian things. And the bath as well. Like this upcoming scene. I suspect we'll be here for a while. It's not a coming up incredibly soon, but once you switch control over the time.
downstairs is beyond me. Where's Charles Lee? Good evening, gentlemen. Oh, Charming. that's silly. Oh, peace, Charles. He'll grow in you. Oi! Catherine, you fussock! Get back here! Daddy needs a drink. How fares the search? Maths and maps are not cutting it. What of your local contacts? We'll need to earn their trust before they'll share what they know. <sighs> Oh, I've no idea on how we might be affecting that. There's a man who's taken to enslaving natives. Rescue us, and they'll owe us. <laughs> Do you know where they're being held? Afraid not. Benjamin Churchwill. He's a finder and a fixer. He's also on your list. And there I was, wondering whom I might solicit next. Well done. Wonderful. <sighs> what a bad ends. Charles? Sir? Seems like we're not the only ones looking for Mr. Church. Damn it, he could be anywhere. What do we do? Find him. Come. I'll show you how. Eavesdrop time. No running allowed. You have but one new and miraculous ointment to turn. Montgomery's pure Should we ointment. Should righteous family, do you think? Not our business to meddle. Even if we've the best of intentions. But if you could have seen it, they were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day, no less. Because if you're standing next to a wall listening, it's not suspicious. But if you're just walking past, that's pretty goddamn suspicious. He keeps up such Truly a shameful display. Benjamin's parents would be mortified. Perhaps I should send someone to retrieve him before he damages his reputation. Stumbled off to the northeast, no doubt in search of a tavern or someone. Start questioning those on the street. I'm headed for higher ground. Time to do some climbing. Most interesting. Boston's not quite as cool to climb as uh, Rome was. Oh, okay.
king of the world. Clean ignorance. Bugger that! They're lying! Aye. Well, what can I do? Threats light off them and I'll not be in trouble. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Arrest one and put him in stocks. Maybe so flip then. Do so without <laughs> we'll set them singing songs about us. <laughs> Fucking bing bongs. Complaining about saying. our abuse of authority. And forget it! The crime is done! The killer's gone! Those who know won't share their secrets. If the city wishes to harbor scoundrels, let them pay the price for it. Oh, the circle gets a little bit tighter every time. did was walk fast. And why are all these guards flickering? do not normally flicker like this. Apparently I've just run into a group of ghost guards. Anyway, I'm on high alert now, so... Which still isn't all that high. Okay. Back to no alert. Walk over this bench. I asked if I could help, and they waved me away. Insisted it was all under control. How far? Did they say what would happen? No. Only that it was a trifling matter, and he'd be returned home soon. There was some blood, though. So I wonder if it wasn't more serious than they let on. Where were they taking them? Towards the hilltop. Perhaps there's a doctor at the fort. A doctor at the fort? Maybe I should go for it. Ah, we'll figure out to go to the fort later. But one way or another, the debt would be settled. We don't envy the man. He's ruined the All I know is that half is good. Probably looking for a nice, quiet place to do the deed. From what I hear tell, his work usually involves quite a bit of screaming. Which reminds me, we'd best not buy any meat. <laughs> Good call, that. Okay, keep going. Oh, nope, we go to the water part now. Charles Lee is following me to the fort. 
I'm supposed to remain undetected when I'm traveling on the US. It's killing me for some reason. See, Charles? We'll have church in no time. The shit. Hope you would. If I might ask. It's too pointy. So you Where did you learn to do all this? It is a requirement when you are raised in the manner that I was. Oh, well. Well, that's a great. Perception is fundamental to the order. It guides the feet when running and climbing, informs the hands when striking and fighting. But most important, it transforms the senses, and we begin to know the world in a different way. Careful. The place is well guarded. We need to slip past them. Gotta get the key to the door. Oh, I found it. I gotta get the door first. Or try to open it, and then it tells us that we need the key, and then we need the key. Oh, blast. We need the key. Uh, uh, yeah. Locked. Hmm. I'll have to find the key. Wait here. God damn it. Why oh, switch out my name? There we go. Okay. This time for real. Fuck it. Can't loot in battle. I'm gonna clean my disc off after this uh, fight because this uh, flashing guard thing is not cool. Drop. Here we are then. Must you always make these things so difficult, Benjamin? Merely provide me with recompense, and all shall be forgiven. I'll not pay for protection I don't need. Clearly, you do require protection. Else we wouldn't be here. How very gutch. Now, what shall we do about our guest? God, they're gonna kill him. They're gonna kill him. I'll take his hands. Put an end to his surgery. Maybe. I'll take his tongue. Put an end to his waggling. Or maybe. I'll take his cock. Put an end to his fucking us. Uh oh. This is intense. So many options. I can't possibly decide. Take all three. No! Hold a moment! Perhaps I was. Hasty in refusing you earlier. I'm so very sorry, Benjamin. But that door has closed. Be reasonable, Silas. I rather think I was. But you took advantage of my no. generosity. I won't be made a fool a second time. <sighs> I 
I fear I lack the constitution to bear witness to such barbarism. Come find me when you're finished, Cutter. You'll regret this, Silas, do you hear me? I'll have your head! No. I rather think you won't. <laughs> I'm proud of it. Your parents must be so very proud to have raised a specimen like yourself. Quiet now. I need to concentrate on me work. Hold still a minute. I got a... That's how it's done. One stab, one shot. One handy thing. Who, who are you? Hatham Kenway, at your service. I don't understand. Why are you here? Walk with me, Mr. Church, and all will be explained. Didn't do that great overall. Indeed, but that's a whole other kettle of fish. And of course, I have to walk up the stairs, talk to someone, walk back down the stairs, get the next part of the mission. <laughs> Johnson's told me what you intend. As it happens, the man who held me is the same one that you seek. His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> Hardly. The man's a commander in King's troop, in charge of the Southgate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitcairn's our man. I'll take you to him. Here we go. Talk to Charles Lee and do the next mission. The soldier. State your business. New recruit. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. Go on, fine. Mike. Sorry, y'all, Mike. You forget, sir. My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending. Oh my God. Pit can, you fool! Your acts are treacherous. Give me one good reason. I shouldn't kill you right now. Were you planning to announce yourself, or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your if arrival? If you'll allow me to explain. Ho <laughs> oh, ho! By all means. I should like very much to hear this. I have not deserted, sir. I am here under Commander Amherst's orders. Show me a letter bearing his seal, and you might be spared the gallows. I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir. It's, it's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hey, them. Hey, I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. We're still flickering. Often travel in packs. Master Pitcairn won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once our work is finished. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles, but they said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Oh 
my god, this is this is distracting. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. Well, that didn't go as I expected. And to think I used to call him brother. What now? They'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. And as luck would have it, so are they. Come along. What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcairn. What? You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol. You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! Fire on you and your false war! Ah! <laughs> oh. on his uniform. After him! Phantom, Edward. Ah, oh, you again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. Swing. Dudes who can't have their attacks countered. They try to switch it up. I mean, look at this. This has never happened to me. I 
stayed my hand today because you were once my brother, and a better man than this. Or should our paths ever cross again, all debts will be forgotten. You're free now, John. Traitor! Go on, then. Join them on their fool's errand. And when you find yourself lying... I assume broken, you've good reason for causing all this madness. Some what is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. After this, there should be one more mission, and then the sequence will be over. And I'll let you guys go. So. Do I go inside? Here goes the last mission of sequence two. Gentlemen, I believe I found the solution to our problem. Or rather, Odysseus has. How do you? Are you a new guy? The Greek hero, you lobcock. Allow me to explain. We enter Silas' fort under the pretext of kinship. Once inside, we spring our trap, free the captives, <laughs> idea. Dodgy. Dodgy. I like it. Then, let us begin. First, we need to find ourselves a convoy. Attack on my signal. Understood, sir. If we time this right, we can catch them all unawares. So stealthy. Assassin's Creed is technically, well, not even technically. It's supposed to be a stealth game, but it really fucking is not at all. What about me? There's like one part in each game where you have to be stealthy. I'll signal you when I have need of your services. We're here to help you, along with those helping us at our kid fort. Creamy. Not until we're inside the gate. I can't chance an inspection of the gate going wrong. I'll see you safe. You have my word. Do you know anything of Silas' operation? How many men we might expect? The nature of their defenses? You must be rather important to him if you are given your own escort. Sir, 
leave enemies ahead. Shall I engage them? No. Let Jonathan and Thomas take care of them. As you wish. I wish you'd trust us. Though I suppose it's only natural. So be it. He really seems to dig this Indian chick. Engage the enemy! Don't even have to fight, they fight for me. Still that flickering right up there. God damn it, dogs! Let no man reach us! Dude, what the fuck? You just killed that dog! Rest in peace, puppy. I don't know why that happened. On your guard, man! Bringing fresh meat, eh? Of course. Yeah. Only say the word, and I'll cut them down. What time is that? Engage the enemy! Who's your officer? wearing disguises since we are literally killing every single person. All clear. But you know, whatever. Good evening, gentlemen. State your business. Delivery for Silas. Go on. See? I'm freeing you just as I said I would. Now, if you'll allow me to explain. Let her go. But she'll give us away. No, she won't. What's the plan? Free the captives and avoid detection. What of Silas? He dies. He dies. I know when you're ready to strike. Well, I actually remember this giving me a little bit of trouble the first time. Not because it's particularly hard, just. It doesn't seem to work entirely. It's weird. Who are we going to do? How fares the watch? Prison. Slouching soldier. I said stop slouching. Who are you to tell me what to do? Good friend of Mr. Archer. Oh. I think, I think, my apologies. Oh. See, I, I backstabbed him and then... It's kind of what happens over and over again. And then you have to do three in a row, so... Sorry. I know when you're ready to strike. <laughs> yeah, it gets deep that fast.
flicker, 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 flicker. This boat one being annoying as fuck. This is the one that really gets stuck because guards just get suspicious as fuck at anything. It's like, oh, this guy's on a boat? Yeah. He's obviously not really a red coat. gonna run because for some reason nobody runs in the Assassin's Creed universe. <laughs> well, Running is considered you suspicious. Now I think I have to get out undetected maybe. Are you f fucking me? Yeah, that happens too. So. Signal when you're ready to strike. Allergies. Kill me. Ah. I find it kind of sad that the Assassin's Creed series is considered like stealth. Splinter Cell. You would be careful as shit. Are you kidding me? I got stuck climbing. Signal when you're ready to strike. This might legitimately be the hardest part of the whole game.
know when you're ready to strike. Okay, let's wait for this officer to... characters would feel deja vu, they'd be like, oh, I think this guy saved me before, but now he's saving me again. Just ignore I said that, please. Let's never mention that again. Climbing. Just not working today. Ha. One more set to free. And I'm being looked at, so... Oi, fellas. Apologies for me tardiness. Carter had me working late. You know Carter? <laughs> well, who's your big boy? Where's this guard? Ah, there he is. Gotta wait for the perfect moment to pop out and murder him. Now I'm get the fuck out. Now that works for me. An hour of quiet was all I asked. Instead, I'm awakened not ten minutes later by this cacophonous madness. I expect an explanation, and it had best be good. How? How did this happen? <laughs> My precious merchandise set free. It's unacceptable. Rest assured, I'll have the heads of those responsible. I don't think the game ever explains why we freed the slaves. We just kind of freed them to free them, because, I mean, Whitey is bad, you know that. Kill any who try to escape. I don't care if they be one of us or one of them. To approach the gate is to be caught. Am I understood?
Also not a very good stealth game if you can't do a non-lethal run. I mean, you should be able to get through most, if not all, of the game without killing anyone. But this is just like ching ching ching, bang bang. It's an action game before it's a. There's nothing wrong with action games. Just it kind of markets itself as a stealth game and. Shitty plebs kinda think of it as a stealth game. I'm not. Am I just supposed to charge at this? I think I am. Are you fucking me? Come on. There we go. Benjamin! I could use some help. Wrecked. Who are you? Ames Hayden Kenway. You don't know me, but I believe the two of you are well acquainted. I made a promise to you, Cyrus. One I intend to keep. And that appears to be the end of the mission. We freed all the Indians. We, uh, for some reason, we, um, that's about all that happened. What happens now? We wait. But not for very long, I suspect. Scene here, I'm guessing, and then I'll quit out. And... So, um, if you like this, it'd be really cool if you subscribed or commented or liked it or whatever. I'm just, I don't know. It's been several Whoa. since we freed the Mohawk prisoners from captivity. The hell? I had hoped their leader might make contact, but there's been only silence. My men grow restless. They want to know what comes next, and I do not have an answer. Lee alone remains active, pursuing leads, however slight. He stalks the city streets and scouts the bordering woods, hopeful that he might make contact with one of those we saved. There was a woman there that night. It was she who helped the others to safety. If we can find her, I believe I'll have... Yeah, that's why we won't find her. I watch and wait, hopeful that my true mission might finally begin. Alright. Now some shitty cutscene. Maybe not. Maybe it just throws you right into the action so I can quit out. Oh, it's winter time now. I think the changing seasons is actually kind of a neat idea, but it's not the most amazing thing I've ever seen. Saving. Oh, saving again. And we'll quit out. Confirm. Goodbye, guys.